to you from the beautiful gardens of the Yanavios Library. Here you see the full perspective. Uh, it is the place where we are having our conference on modern Stoicism, making Greek philosophy practical and relevant to modern human beings, modern professionals, and people who want more meaning in their life, people who want to live with values. First time in history that all the Stoics from the whole world are joining here in Athens, the place where Stoicism was born. And it's, it's been a very moving experience to see people from Japan, people from New Zealand, people really from the other edges from here in Europe. It's, you know, just very moving to see people interested in Greek philosophy and how they can make it relevant. So it, there's been a lot of preparation, several months in the making with our team from the Modern Stoicism organization. And it's been a very moving occasion to experience the Greek light, this pure Greek light, to really visit the Stoa, to visit the Parthenon, and all the, really the original places where these things were conceived. So, yeah, let me take you around to the gardens a little and show you what we've been experiencing. share with you myself, you know, and not just a pretty face. <laughs> <laughs> so Socrates, the great Greek philosopher, once said and taught that in order to lead others, we must first learn to lead ourselves. Now, I mean, think about it. How can you lead others if you can't lead your own anger and anxiety, right? How can you manage others if you can't manage your own stress and, you know, reactions. Uh, so it's logical to, to determine and understand that self-leadership is by far the most important skill we can develop. Uh, just a bit for after that, uh, any of you who want, we happen to be on Mount Ligabetas, which some of you may want to take a cable car or walk up the, the mountain, and you can have a view all the way to the sea, to the Athenian Riviera, which is not far from the center. 